We are just over nine months away from the total solar eclipse with Cleveland being a prime viewing spot because we are right in what's called the path of totality. Today, local tourism and business leaders shared their plans for the big event. When the moon actually comes in between the sun and the earth, it causes a shadow to be cast on the earth's surface. And this happens actually around every 18 months somewhere on, on the planet. But in a specific location, it's normally between 300 and 1,000 years that you get uh, a total solar eclipse. Once in a lifetime, we did say. Destination Cleveland hosted the virtual presentation along with NASA, which chose Cleveland as one of three locations in the country where the space agency will broadcast live on April 8, 2024. Tourism leaders say the eclipse could bring in $100 million to the state's economy as sky watchers flock to Northeast Ohio for this once in a lifetime event. And Cleveland gets an added boost, but mind you, the eclipse comes a day after the NCAA Women's Final Four Championship game at Rocket Mortgage. In Cleveland, the eclipse reaches its maximum effect at 3.15 p.m. on April 18th when the moon is fully blocking our view of the sun. So there is what's called an annular solar eclipse this October. However, the sun won't be completely blocked out. Just so you know, the last total solar eclipse seen in Ohio was back in 1806. The next one, not until 2099.